Greetings, folks. Dharma Bum here with another video about a special event in real VR fishing. This one is to catch a convict sergeant fish, which is only available during events like this one. We have only until August 26th. To get there, choose map. And when the map appears, click on the location off the west coast of North America. Then click on the Convict Strikes Back poster. Click on Go Fishing and you're on your way. You'll arrive at the event location, a version of Kaina Point in Hawaii, but with fewer fish. The limited time fish we're here to catch is easy to catch once hooked, but a little hard to find. Clues to how to catch it are, as always, in the fish guidebook. We can see that the convict sergeant fish can be found at any depth and prefers dough balls, worms, and krill. A quick look at the other fish tells us that there are a few others fond of dough balls and krill, but only one other fish loves worms, the greenling. You may already know that the kelp greenling is a pretty big fish. If you haven't already caught one, I bet you will soon. So the worm is the best way to find and catch the convict. Choose the nicest worm that you can afford, A or maybe B. In the store, the six kinds of baits come in three different qualities and prices. C are free or cheap. B are mid-range and fish come to them more easily than C. A is the most expensive and the best at attracting fish. Always use the highest grade of bait and gear you can afford. Best rod, best bait, bobber, and reel. During this event, you can catch the epic convict sergeant fish even if you're just a level one, and you can catch it at normal difficulty. Events are magic. With a worm on our hook, we'll put on our glasses and look for a green small fish. Green because it likes worms, small because it's little compared to the only other worm loving fish. If we don't find it, we do a reset. Bring up the B menu, click settings, and click either hard or expert, and then back to normal. Click the trigger to see the fish and look for a small roundish green outline. Hard to see even with a zoom. To be sure you have the correct fish, you can tap your joystick 
to the left twice to see it turn green because it likes dough balls. I went back to the worm and simply cast toward it. Unfortunately, another nearby fish is also green for worms and strikes. Since I don't want that one, I just didn't pull up to set the hook. I rotated bait to the dough ball that the nearby fish don't care for. The little guy goes for the bait. Notice that after I set the hook, the meter shows this epic fish is pretty weedy. It's very easy to reel in. No struggle at all. It takes no pulling to the left or the right. This is good to know if you give expert difficulty a try. And there it is, smaller than my hand. Convict number 12, 84 credits. The brief snazz sound and the white glow around the bait tells me the fish ate the dough ball. Since there were no other little green fish, I do another reset and have a look around to see evidence of how well a reset works. You can find and watch the chapter Improve Your Chances with a Reset in my Golden Catfish video. It's about 12 minutes in. So here I've spotted another little round green fish found on the second reset. When I cast and hook a fish and begin to reel it in, that big fin and the meter tell me it's a bigger fish than the convict. So I release it from the line by briefly pulling the thumbstick toward me. Now I'm going to speed up the video since we've seen a convict caught at normal before. But what amazes me about this is that I can catch that I catch two in a row with no reset between them. Convict number 13, 84 credits. Caught with a dough ball. In a moment, we'll talk about catching the convict at expert difficulty. More challenging. Greater earnings, though. Convict number 14, 85 credits, caught with a worm. To catch a convict at expert, B button to open the menu, settings, and click on expert. The trick here is finding the fish. Those white slashes are from fish near the top of the water, but they are too big and bright, as well as too persistent and moving too quickly. The small size of the convict gives us a barely visible white slash and one that fades quickly. I spent a lot of time not catching the convict before I located this one. 
but I do enjoy whale watching. This little white slash disappears, but I keep fishing the area, ever hopeful. Looking around for other prospects. The vague slash has disappeared and reappeared farther left. I recast even farther left. My bobber will drift right. My line turns pink. Finally! A little interest. Straight on in. Convict number 15. 261 credits. Caught with a worm. Since I didn't see any more vague white slashes on the water, reset again. Normal or hard, then back to expert. Because the convict fish is so easy to catch, this event makes a good moment for those used to fix fishing at normal to give expert a try. You could even go ahead and try to catch something bigger. If it strikes your bait, most of the fish at this location are fairly mild-mannered. You'll probably catch some kelp greenlings, and you might even catch a different epic. Anyway, hope this video helps you catch convicts. Wishing you good fishing. And thanks for watching.